do contraceptive hormones affect women's desire and arousal? What is the influence of pornography on the sexual education of young people? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Contraceptive hormones can affect women's sexual desire and arousal. Some women may experience changes in desire due to hormonal influences, but responses vary depending on the type of contraceptive and the individual. The influence of pornography on the sexual education of young people can be complex. Pornography may provide inappropriate or unrealistic information about sex, distorting expectations. It is important for young people to have access to comprehensive and evidence-based sexual education to balance this influence. Improvement in emotional well-being. Masturbation can be an effective way to reduce anxiety, improve mood, and promote emotional well-being by releasing tension and increasing the sensation of pleasure. Increase in cases. Despite efforts in sexual education and prevention, STD cases are on the rise in many parts of the world, especially among young people. Increasing popularity. Open relationships are gaining popularity in modern society, with more people opting for this type of dynamic instead of traditional monogamous relationships. Inflation fetishism. This fetish involves sexual excitement related to the inflation of the body or body parts, either through physical means or visual representations. Influence of food on sex. Some foods are considered aphrodisiacs due to their supposed ability to increase sexual desire. Popular examples include chocolate, oysters, and avocado. Influence of sexual education. Comprehensive, evidence-based sexual education can help promote sexual health and reduce the risk of unwanted pregnancies and sexually transmitted diseases among young people. Influence of technology on sexuality. Technology has changed how people experience sexuality. Online connected applications and sexual toys are examples of how technology has integrated into modern sexual life. Integrity and honesty. Honesty and integrity are qualities that many people find attractive in a partner. Reliability and transparency are valued in a relationship. In Japan, sex education tends to be more focused on biology and reproduction, with less emphasis on emotional aspects and interpersonal relationships. However, due to easy access to online pornography, many young people obtain information about sex from non-educational sources. In contemporary Japanese society, manga and anime often address topics related to sexuality and interpersonal relationships, providing young people with an alternative source of information on these subjects. Kama Sutra in gastronomy. Some restaurants offer themed menus inspired by the Kama Sutra, where dishes and drinks bear suggestive names and are creatively presented to stimulate the senses. Kama Sutra-inspired tattoos. Some people choose tattoos based on the Kama Sutra as a way to express their connection to sensuality and eroticism, using symbols and figures from the ancient text. Key communication. Open and honest communication is fundamental in open relationships to avoid misunderstandings and strengthen trust between partners. Lasting memories. Memories of satisfying foreplay can linger long after the sexual encounter ends, strengthening the emotional bond and keeping the spark of passion alive in the relationship. In rural communities in Latin America, sexual education workshops may be conducted by health promoters and community leaders, addressing topics such as family planning, disease prevention, and communication in relationships. Leather fetishism involves sexual attraction towards wearing leather clothing, both on oneself and on a partner. In the LGBTQ community, inclusive and affirmative sexual education is essential to address the specific needs of queer, transgender, and non-binary individuals, promoting acceptance and diversity in all sexual orientations and gender identities. Lingerie fetishism. This fetish focuses on sexual arousal caused by a partner's underwear or lingerie, 
which may include garments such as bras, panties, thongs, etc. Low-cost toys. While some sex toys can be expensive, there are also more affordable options available in the market, making sexual pleasure exploration accessible to a wide variety of people. Lucid dreams are those in which a person is aware they are dreaming and can take control of their dream. Some people report having sexual experiences in lucid dreams. Masturbation and empowerment. For many women, masturbation is a form of sexual empowerment by taking control of their own pleasure and exploring their sexuality without shame or taboos. Masturbation and self-awareness. Both men and women can learn more about their bodies and sexual responses through masturbation. Self-exploration can help discover which type of stimulation is most effective in achieving orgasm. Masturbation as a healthy practice. Masturbation is a normal and healthy sexual activity that can provide pleasure, relieve stress, and help people learn about their own bodies and sexual desires. Masturbation in the animal kingdom. Masturbation is not exclusive to humans. Some animals, such as primates, dolphins, and certain birds, also masturbate for various reasons. In some indigenous cultures in Latin America, such as the Maya in Guatemala, there are ancestral traditions that include teaching about sexuality as an integral part of life and individual worldview. Medications and side effects. Some prescribed medications, such as antidepressants, antipsychotics, and medications for high blood pressure, can have side effects that include erectile dysfunction. Mental stimulation. Sexual arousal in women can be closely linked to mental stimulation. Foreplay can involve erotic conversations, innuendos, and anticipation that set the stage for a satisfying sexual experience. Multiple female orgasms. Some women experience multiple orgasms in a single sexual session. This may result from increased sensitivity and the ability to maintain sexual desire after the first orgasm. Multiple orgasms in women. Some women can experience multiple orgasms in a single sexual session. This can result from continuous stimulation and the ability to have several orgasms in a short period. Multiple pathways. While clitoral stimulation is a common way to achieve a female orgasm, some women may experience orgasms through stimulation of other areas, such as nipples or the G-spot. Myths and taboos. Throughout history, female masturbation has been surrounded by myths and taboos. However, it is increasingly recognized as a normal and healthy part of female sexuality. It is important to challenge and overcome these stigmas to promote a positive attitude towards sexual self-exploration in women. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.